Imagine the most emotionally devastating events in your life flashing in front of you like a movie trailer. And I try to imagine those events in control of your mind when they can appear at any given time, any given moment. Post-traumatic stress disorder. For many veterans, the real battle starts at home, long after the war has ended. When my company was in Iraq, there were 15 killed in action. Losing my friends was a pretty big deal for a very long time. I started noticing a change in my husband after he came back from Iraq. It changes you just like that. Things just happen inside and you can't figure them out. A man gave his life for me. And now for the rest of my life, I get to watch it happen over and over and over again. The mind is really strong, but at the same time, it's extremely fragile. One of the most challenging issues veterans face is not just receiving help, but asking for it. And I think there's a lot of people that are probably in dark places. So you get this tight-knit group of guys that put their asses on the line and then we send them back and they don't fit. And nobody back here understands that. So just give me back the uniform and let me go back. This is the story of veterans' battles and sacrifices, a war at home, and the iron will they possess to never give up. If you think that this is the end of the line, remember why you signed. It's all our responsibility to help take care of these men and women who put it all on the line. If giving somebody a service dog changes their life, then we did something right. The first step is just talking with someone. Please reach out. And I think everybody can use a coach. Whatever you're doing, somebody else is stepping alongside you and saying, I believe you, and walking with you in that journey. It's not even a journey, it's a struggle. But what I've really learned is there's power in the struggle. You have to struggle, you have to be uncomfortable to be able to grow and to be able to heal. You're not alone. And at the end of the day, you control your circumstances, they don't control you.